So in this video, I'm going to show you how to edit textures in Frosty Editor for PVZ Garden Warfare 2. For this tutorial, I'm going to be changing Zomburbia Sky Texture. To do this, I'll go to the Worlds folder, open Textures, then Sky, and I'll find the texture I want to replace the Zomburbia Skybox with. I'm going to use the Frontline Flat Sky Texture. Click the Export option in the top left-hand corner to save the image to your PC. Now, let's find Zomburbia's Sky Texture asset. And click the Import option in the top left-hand corner to replace this texture with the one we just exported. Okay then, we have just changed how Zomburbia's sky looks. I'm going to save my project right here. And I'm going to call it Daytime. Zomburbia. Before I launch the game, I need to share with you a few quick pro tips about texture modding. The dimensions of any texture you import into Frofty must be a multiple of 4. If you try to import a texture in that isn't, Frofty will crash. Also, Frosty only accepts images that are in a PNG file format, so if the texture you wish to import is a JPG file, you will need to convert that. Anyways, let's launch our game to see how Zomburbia's new sky looks. <laughs> Look at that, Zomburbia's got a brand new sky. Of course it doesn't match very well with the lighting, but I can show you how to fix that in a future tutorial. So make sure to stick around my channel for even more epic modding tutorials like this one. Catch you next time.